and welcome to Case of the Day. I'm Dr. Crowley and today we're going to discuss an interesting case uh, and um, some new technology that's been around for the last few years. Had a lady come in today who just had cataract surgery this week and she comes in for her first post-op visit and um, prior to surgery she was very nearsighted and she had six diopters of astigmatism. Now you may not know what that means but Basically, six diopters of astigmatism is a lot. Very few people have that much astigmatism. So, what is astigmatism? Astigmatism means that the shape of the cornea in front of the eye, that, that cornea is shaped more like a football cut in half, that is, is real steep on one side and not as steep on the other side, versus a basketball that's cut in half, which is round all the way around. So someone who has a cornea shaped like a basketball doesn't have astigmatism. They could be nearsighted or farsighted, but they don't have any astigmatism. This person happened to be very nearsighted, as well as the cornea was shaped like a football, so therefore, um, they were very blurred for two reasons. One, they were nearsighted, and two, a lot, a lot of astigmatism. So, the reason I'm talking to her about, about her today is she came in with just a smile that just you was just unbelievable. And the reason was is the first day post-operatively, she is now 20-20 without glasses at distance. And so how did that happen? Well, we now have uh, implants or intraocular lenses that have the astigmatism in the implant, just like glasses have astigmatism in the glasses, so with glasses you're able to correct that astigmatism or contact lenses as well. So with this type of lens, which we call a toric intraocular lens, with this type of lens we were able to correct her astigmatism. And it's just recently that we had a lens that would be strong enough to correct six diopters of astigmatism. With that much astigmatism, you would, she was lucky to see the wall, much less any letters on the wall. And so today she is 20-20 without glasses. So when we work someone up to have cataract surgery, it has a lot of astigmatism. We take a lot of measurements of the eye, how the curvatures of the eye and the size of the eye, and, and we have computerized machines that then calculate what strength of lens do we put inside the eye to correct someone who's nearsighted or farsighted? And also, the companies that make these intraocular lenses that are toric or astigmatism lenses have a formula as well that we then go to their website, put in all the measurements we've got on the patient, and then it prints out a strength of um, toric intraocular lens that we can place in this person's eye to correct their astigmatism and vision, whether they're nearsighted or farsighted. And so that's what we did in this case. There are two companies that make toric lenses in the United States. The one is Alcon, which makes their Acrosoft uh, toric intraocular lens, and then Star makes their toric intraocular lens. And so um, those are the two lenses we have that we can use. Um, and most people do extremely well with these kind of lenses. So if you have astigmatism, and when the doctor checks your eyes, and, they, and, and you may already know from your glasses that you have astigmatism, and you need cataract surgery, there is a way to correct your vision with using this type of lens, and it works just fantastic. People are just really thrilled. I would say 90 to 95% or even, or even maybe a little more than that, of people who have a toric intraocular lens placed in their eye do not wear or need glasses for distance vision. They're able to see the TV, drive a car, and do all normal activities with this type of lens. So it was just seeing her today and such a smile on her face, I just thought this would be an interesting thing to talk about, that cataract surgeries changed so much over the last few years that is done through that very small incision. And these lenses, if you have astigmatism, that are toric intraocular lenses just work fantastic. So if you have any questions about this, feel free to contact us through the website. If not, may God bless you with healthy eyes and great vision.